are the five hot sports. Move over football, basketball, and baseball. High school athletes are scoring points in the fast-growing alternatives. Um, our, our athletic director, Dr. Dr. Labrera, is quoted in the first paragraph saying that students are finding, are, are, are moving away from um, the high-impact sports and finding other sports and other avenues, um, which is increasing participation. Um, and in, within the article, our fencing coach is quoted. We have a tremendous fencing team. I, I, w I was, uh, helped uh, my neighbor kind of pick my brain a little bit on how to start that here, which I was thrilled to do. Um, they talk about our girls ice hockey team, one of the fastest growing sports in the state and in the country, really. Um, believe it or not, uh, we at this point in time, we're sharing that with Madison. Um, but that has created a, a, a league in the state of New Jersey, which is getting a lot of support statewide. And uh, Kevin Hannon is our um, big proponent of that and our um, volunteer coach. So I hope we can, can, can support them and the paddle team and the sailing team. Um, the other one we have is, believe it or not, we have a boys volleyball team. I had, I, yeah. this was new, I just read about. We're, we got a shout out there. Of course, we got a shout out for our paddle team being the first one in the country. Um, and may I just add that the number one youth player plays for our team, rated in the country. The number one junior paddle tennis player in the United States plays for Chatham High School varsity team. So shout out to that. And the, the numbers on that seem to be impressive, too, and I hope that, like Michelle said, we can look to fund those. Our sailing team, as well, was shouted out. I'm glad that we're able to continue that, because that's, that lake paddle is a co-ed sport, so we're thrilled that we can have boys and girls competing together. And um, so I just want to say that we got a great shout out in this magazine, and I'm so proud of the kids and the parent volunteers and the coaches who uh, dedicate their time to help these children uh, participate and find a place and represent their school uh, in just doing great things and being successful because we are pretty successful in all those options and they're not the traditional sports and I encourage the board to keep looking at these things and finding creative ways to, to pull some funding for them because I think they would appreciate anything we could give them because we are getting not only recognized in the state, but we're getting recognized nationally as well. So cheers to, cheers to you guys.